Hello everyone, I'm your host Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. So now we're going here with Eligard. Creeper's still there. Okay, just a little farther. Oh, the whole front of the house is different now. That's certainly impressive. Wow. It's not all redstoney. Now it has like jack o' lanterns and flowers. There's anyway, the creeper, and now it's dead. Who goes there? I goes there. Jesse? Is that you? You build all this? I forget what I asked the first time I did this cutscene. Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice! I'm so glad you're back. And we brought Eligard! Fantastic! Quick, come on. You guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone. Petra. Hey guys, how's it going? <laughs> yes, yes, Pig's very happy. I'm so glad you're okay, Petra. Yeah, I'm pretty stoked about it myself. And it's really good to see you, Jesse. Oh. Back there in Gabriel's bunker. Uh, I don't escape? understand. How did you escape? You pulled me out of that Witherstorm's crutches, and I ran and ran and ran for the temple. If you hadn't saved me, well, I owe you everything, Jesse. I'm just glad I heard Gabriel telling you where to go. Wow. Did Gabriel get away too? Did you see? It's all a blur, but the weather storm left almost nothing behind. Everything. Everyone. was just gone. Hmm. It even got Gabriel. I wouldn't believe that anything could defeat Gabriel if I hadn't seen it for myself. This is terrible. Okay. Now you're gonna see him and you're gonna be all cranky. Can't remember the last time I saw this place. Would someone care to explain what he is doing here? Call this a hunch, but do you two not like each other? Right. I forgot to mention. Axel went on a little adventure of his own while you were gone. An adventure to get him? Did you know about this? Why didn't you tell me? Isn't that Magnus you the did Rogue? This on purpose. Holy crap, I can't believe it. That's Magnus the Rogue. Uh, I always forget that there are people that actually like seeing that idiot. Look, just wait here a second while I figure out what's going on. Much appreciated. Okay. So, who are you then? And why'd you bring the Queen of the Nerds with you? That's Jesse, my best friend. Trust me, Jesse's totally cool. I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll be the judge of that, huh? We're reuniting the Order of the Stone. I got tired of waiting around, so I decided to go recruit Magnus myself. It was kind of a crazy adventure, but it all worked out in the end. And now, I'm the king of Boomtown. Oh. Ah! We've been bonding and stuff. I've had, like, the best day. Way to go, Axel. Well, it wasn't easy. I had to beat him in a crazy tournament and... Long story, you had to beat him. Short version, epic battle of explosions and mayhem, death-defying action, shenanigans, and pyrotechnic. Bada-bing, bada-boom! Your friend here is kind of supreme ruler of my kingdom now, you know what I mean? Well, this is unexpected. I'm not entirely sure what you mean. But I'm definitely sure that I don't like it. Oh, God. Yeah, show him some respect. Oh, you're sticking up for Magnus. That's very sweet. Yeah, he's sticking up for me. It's because I'm really awesome and super cool. I'll never understand your fans. Neither will I. all cut it out? You're both assholes, crap, as I've discovered. Like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry wither storm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner? It was terrifying. It came out of nowhere and just destroyed everything. Little too scary for you, Ellie? Couldn't just think it away? You weren't there, Magnus. I'm telling you, this thing was like nothing I've ever seen. Why? Because it's never come inside one of your little workshops? This arguing isn't helping anything. The They're both assholes. It's just two sides of the same asshole coin. Firepower. Jesse's right. We need to find some way to stop that thing. Well, 
I don't know if you've had the chance to poke around this old dump yet, but it's pretty much stripped bare. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. I know they're gonna agree. This is amazing. I know. Can't we Can make we some? start crafting some then? I don't think we got that kind of time. But against such an unthinkable enemy, even all the TNT in the world might not be enough. Only Soren were here. He might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie. Not this again. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. What are you talking about? What did Soren have? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formidabomb. F-bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-bomb before. F-bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F bomb could destroy anything. I mean, but in certain contexts. I've never seen it's it real. Before. I swear. This thing sounds in impossible. How could it even exist? Impossible objects were Soren's specialty. We don't know where Soren is. But you found us. Do you know where he is? I have the fancy thingy that lets me find the fancy assholes. So are they all. Gabriel wasn't a prick. Gabriel was kind of just like. I'm the big. He's kind of like um. Our map could locate him. Oh, he was kind of like All Might map. from Hero the... Academy but or it's Academia. Worth a shot. I don't know what the English proper name is. I bet we can find him. And use the pedestal. Oh look, it's you. Oh wait, I gotta pull the lever. Come on. We've already seen this part. Hurry up. I want to see what the option for staying overnight here was. There's two other main differences, I bet. There's probably the stay here overnight, and then if I took the left path once All I was right. inside the building. Here's your light, my light. Shwomp. So here's, watch this. Soren's at the top That's now. Me. There he is. But it's, now it's on the right of theirs. The There's some real the big bugs with this game. Back. That's where he went to keep doing his experiments. They don't affect Look, performance, but he me there it's... A couple times. I don't know. It seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that at any rate. Well, let's stop hanging around here and go get us some super TNT. And there's the asshole. Whoa. It didn't do that before. Sure What's his beef? Why is he being that? such a... He's like the assholiest of the assholes. No, it's... That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move. Hmm. Not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Wretches! Right. We'll get some rest and head out first thing in the morning. Avoiding all the... Nighttime. Monsters. Everything. If you had seen that monster, you wouldn't be saying Oh. That. We need to leave now. Interesting. I think it's following us, Magnus, and I don't want to risk it catching up with us. We have to go now. It's so bad that you're going to just go waltzing out in the woods at night. It's not night yet. We'll just go as fast as we can. Hmm. I think Magnus might be right. And he's not usually a big fan of safety. Of course you'd pick his side. I don't want to risk being outside when it gets dark. So they, there's four possible scenarios here. Messi here is talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that. You're just saying that because it's your plan, but fine. So if I had gone, okay, so if you pick Magnus, you can stay or you can go in the night. If you pick Eligard, you can go or you can stay in the night. So there's four different possibilities. Minor dialogue differences, I guess. Okay, everyone, rest up. Head out at first light, all right? I was listening to you, dumbass. I appreciate you giving us a chance to rest, Jesse. I hate to admit it, but I needed this. Yo, we haven't really gotten the chance to chat yet. Oh, hello. So, you're Ellie's protege? <laughs> She's a piece of work, isn't she? Hmm. Always thinking about all her redstone stuff. She's a little Always intense. Always trying to show off how smart she is. She's definitely intense, that's for sure. Kind of have a hard time keeping up with her. Tell me about it. I always feel like she's looking at all the people around her and judging them. Like, what kind of shtick is that, you know? You're not anyway, wrong. 
Thanks for having my back before. I do appreciate it. How you liking being the leader of this little pack? I know I haven't been around here long, but even I can tell there's some unrest in the ranks. Mm. Huh. Especially between Axel and, uh, what's her name? Uh, Olivia. They were getting, getting along the fine. We can get through anything. Huh. Wish my gang had that kind of commitment. Hope you're right. Hmm. Anyway, small fry, let's get some sleep. We've got a long walk ahead of us in the morning. So are we just going to end up at the place? Oh no, we actually are walking through the woods in the day. Look at all the flowers. I'm not sure how the rest of you are feeling, but I feel fantastic. I think that a little sleep is just what I needed. <laughs> Wish I felt as good as you sound. I'm still feeling a little under the weather. Oh, it's here now, isn't uh, it? Guys? Holy shit! It's so much bigger this in this. Exactly what I was afraid of. It caught up with us. Holy snack burglars! You weren't kidding. No, not again. What? How did it get the night already? What? What bullshit is this? Except it's monsters, but now there's also the weather storm in the background. That's weird. How did it instantly become night, or is he just like blocking out the sun? Why is he swings randomly? I'm not even pressing buttons when he does that. Okay. All the zombies. Come on, we gotta get out of here. I am getting very tired of this wither storm. Yeah, so there are four possible scenarios. Not again. Swords isn't much farther. We can make it. Sora's place has got to be just ahead. Come on. See, this is what I was talking about. Is it seems like they did as much work as they would do in a normal episode of their, one of their games, but it's all diced up because of all the choices. That's the trade-off. Is there are actual choices in this game versus the other ones, which are kind of like, yeah, it all leads to the same ending, except the last few cutscenes might be a little different. But here, it's actually two different places. So far from it's I don't know anyone. Enchanting, isn't it? It's I mean obviously the best would be it had all the effort and it was the actual length of an episode, but there were that many different choices. But it's likely not going to happen. Not with this game, at least. Yeah, and I'm really not feeling those columns. They didn't really explain why the Endermen it's were here. Fine. Look, woo. So this part's exactly the same. Don't fall, okay? Oh, that is deep. That is very, very deep. I wonder if it's gonna remember that I have the stone and the redstone dust and all that in the next episodes. Oh no, Ruben's in danger. Will I save him? Saved him. Jesse, you okay? That was crazy. Yeah, I'm fine. How about you, Reuben? <laughs> what a rush. Whoa. They didn't really explain the Enderman, though. Look. What is that? Enderman. Hmm. <laughs> We made it. Looks rough down there. Yeah, no kidding. Come on, we should get out of here. Olivia and the others already went ahead. Wow, this architecture is incredible. I still think, yeah, he's the parallel the for Soren. Guess we better catch up. Uh, Lucas, that is. And the main character is, is supposed to be. The parallel for Ivor. 
All be quiet. Yeah, because Ivor was like the leader too. Building. That's all I'm saying. That's it. I'm going. Once again, it falls to me to take care of Ooh, everything. Ooh, got blurry there for a second. I'll find this super TNT myself. Oh no no no! You do not get to be the one who walks away. That's it. I'm going. Hmm. See, I'm walking away too now. Super TNT. So I Here went down I his come. path before. Let me go down the other. It's hard to pick glass half full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Bickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. Hmm. What are we gonna do now? Where should we go? Let's figure it out. Ooh, your arms went kind of crazy for a second. I wonder if this is still the original Telltale engine, which is really dated at this point. What, can I not? Okay, there we go. We're gonna go this way. Petra, are you okay? I'm sorry. I don't mean to worry you. I've just got something I want to discuss with you in private. It was Ruben so let's with us? Up. Yeah, he was. Hmm. Whoa. So is it exactly the same cutscene? I feel bad about ditching everyone else, but I just wanted to talk to you about this alone. Let me it's see. Oops, I didn't want to say it that way. I hope it's as important as you're saying it is. Jesse, of course it's important. Whoops. You got me away from the wither storm. But I'm worried that I didn't get away soon enough. Let's see if, if this is the same cutscene, I'm just gonna if he falls in the hole at the end, then that's just gonna be it for this episode because I've already seen the other parts. It showed up not we too need to get help. To save me. Holy crap, what are we doing down here? We need to get you help. I don't know if there's anything we can do, Jesse. I'm curious if at least if I, if I do fall in the hole, if I'm gonna come from a different direction when wither, I get to the library. Of course. We've been... No, Jesse. Just wither or wither sickness, I guess. And I feel like it's just gonna keep getting worse. Well, we're gonna go back and tell the others we can get help. You can't tell anyone about this. Oh. Okay, here's the creeper. Ah, creeper! And I'm gonna fall in the hole. Grab my hand, pull you up. And you're gonna drop me. And I'm gonna get a severe concussion. It is exactly the same, the path. Jesse, I just couldn't. I'm sorry. Jesse? Don't worry, I'm fine. I keep forgetting the character's name. It's okay. Jesse. I got this. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. Unlikely. <laughs> Piggy. Ruben's the real hero in all this. What is happening to the joystick? All right. Please at least let it come from a different angle when I get to the library part. Because it's been what? Between the th this is the fifth episode I've done of this? So it would be around 20, 20, 25 minutes average each one. That's not a lot of content. I guess that's why this this game was a lot cheaper than the other Telltales at their launch, I think. This was like... Wait, maybe it wasn't. I don't know. I'm not disappointed, because I understand how much work it would be to make all those different areas. It's just... It's oh, underwhelming, is the word I would use. Like, when I play a Telltale game, I expect at least two or three hours of gameplay. I finished this episode originally in an hour and change that is way too short oh man it is from the same angle as the other cutscenes or as the other mission or, or other options all right so that's enough I'm I don't need to see the rest of that I am curious though choices So two. Um, what happened here? Huh? The game crashed. I can't do anything. Pressing all the buttons. 
Okay, well, hey, that's a point to end it on, I guess. What the hell? So, yeah, it's... Here's hoping episode 3. Maybe that's why episode 2 came out so fat. No, because they still put work into it. It's just... The work is cut up, and you don't get to see all of it in one go. But even factoring in, I saw that the different cutscenes total up for maybe, maybe two hours total of different content. I don't know. It's weird. It's it's uncharacteristic of Telltale. It's like more like their early, early stuff that was, eh, like the Back to the Future game and all that. But I don't know. I mean, still, it's open-minded. I'll reserve judgment or anything like that until the very last episode is out because. Usually with Telltale, it's episode one is solid, two, three, four, even maybe kind of are sloped up and down. They might be better, might be worse. And then five usually blows you away. Like, well, no, because Tales from the Borderlands, all of those episodes were solid as a rock. And the fifth episode was fucking fantastic. That's it. Like, it was, it blew me away. Let's see if this game can hold a candle to that, I guess. But yeah, so thanks for joining me. Come back all the next stuff up real soon, but until then, bye.